Hopefully this will stay in focus. It's like 8.20 a.m. right now. Let me check. 8.24 a.m. Um, I kind of just woke up, so I still have a bare face because I'm gonna take a shower later. And right now I have to post something on social media for a club I'm in and I have class at 9 a.m. So I have like 30 minutes before I need to get ready for class. I have these blue light glasses. Um, I like like shit in them, but whatever, they protect my eyes. So don't you just hate it when professors suddenly assign like videos for you to watch randomly at 8.30 a.m.? Well, I guess it's 11.30 for them, but still. So I have to watch that now. Um, this is from my IR class. I love my professor, but he gives sporadic assignments and I don't like to wait to do them, so now I have to watch this video lecture. Another thing I like about my professor is that he actually puts a ton of effort into these videos. So I've been way too lazy to handwrite, so nowadays I just split my screen and I have like the video over there and then my notes over here, which I just type. And of course, I got a drink green tea. At 9 a.m. I have my history class and it's history of the Pacific world. So as my professor lectures, I just take notes by drawing text boxes on the PowerPoint presentations. After class, I just do a quick morning workout. So I do the April Han leg slimming workout and then the Pamela Reeve 10 minute ab workout. Hello, um, it's like 10.40 and I just showered, um, I have another cup of tea and I don't, I'm supposed to have class at 11, like a science class, but this week we don't have synchronous like meetings, instead we're just doing this project where we have to watch a video and write like a two page response paper, so hopefully I can grind that out in like an hour, because I realized that I've been studying for my history midterm wrong, I thought it was open note, Turns out it's not, so I have to make a bunch of quizlets for that. Um, yeah. Alright, I completely forgot to film. It's already 12.30 and I just finished my lunch, or like half of my lunch. I always eat yogurt like for every single meal, so right now I have... I just microwaved apples, put a bunch of cinnamon, have Greek yogurt, pumpkin seeds, and a few pieces of cinnamon toast crunch. such a nice day out. I'm so sad because I can only go on like a, a 20 minute walk right now since I have to be back home by one o'clock but afterwards after I attend class I'm gonna go on another walk. Okay so in the podcast I'm listening to they're talking about like astrology so the person talking Nana Florence is a Pisces and I'm realizing a lot of similarities between her and I. Um, we're both very old soul and our alcohol tolerance sucks so i was just throwing that out there this coffee chat was really really cool so professor bonnie jenkins is super duper qualified and has done like everything you could do in the international relations field i definitely recommend checking her out if you're interested in international relations International relations is like going to start in just a few minutes. It's a huge lecture class, so I just have to take notes as my teacher um, does his PowerPoint slideshow. I don't have to turn on my camera or anything. And every week we have like a bunch of readings for the course, but they're all super interesting. And this is the one where like I really like my professor, but um, not so excited about how he randomly assigns video lectures to watch in the middle of the day or in the middle of the night. I also have my midterm for this class coming up next week and we have to write two 750 to 1500 word essays, so I'm really not looking forward to that. As you can tell, I'm obsessed with taking walks and this one is just at a neighborhood farm park. And then as soon as I got back, 
I had to attend a meeting for a club called the Caravel, and we just outlined basically our assignments for the week. Okay, so it's like almost five o'clock. Um, I'm finally done with all my club meetings and classes for today. So right now I'm just doing some reading for my theology class for reading a novel called Silence by Shusake Endo. It's like about a Portuguese missionary who goes to Japan. Um, and technically I don't have to do, like I don't have to finish the novel until next Thursday, but I just wanna get as much reading in as possible um, and try to finish it by today. I gave up right before the last chapter and did some quick graphic work. I did eventually finish the novel though. For dinner, I had cabbage and hot sauce. I can literally put hot sauce in anything. And I also had sweet potatoes with Greek yogurt, with cinnamon, with peanut butter, and it's an awesome combo. It is now 7.30, um, I'm basically done for the day, and I finished during someone at like 7, washed my face, went on a walk, and now I'm about to do my actual workout. Um, okay, it's not an actual workout, it's like 20 minutes, and then I stretch, but I will be back after that. I finished working out, um, I changed, and I have aloe vera on my skin, so if you see shiny stuff, it's not sweat, it's just aloe vera. And it's like 8.30, um, I have to do some graphic design stuff for a club, and then I think after that I'm just gonna like listen to some audiobooks, play some phone games, and if I'm feeling extra productive, I'm gonna grind out another Quizlet. I still have four left to do, but I did four today, so I don't think it should take that long. And I think overall today was pretty productive, so I'm quite happy. I ended the day with some journaling while watching Jen Im's YouTube video. I love her. Totally recommend watching her if you don't already. And besides that, that was basically my day. I'm really boring. I basically have the same schedule every single day. And I also sleep really, really early. So after this, I basically went to bed at like 11 o'clock and just done. <laughs>